Horses are on the track and pretty the post for the 11th race. Phillies and mares, condition pace of one mile, a purse of $4,200, exact to try effect a pick three wagering. Scratch the one, digital lady sick, a field of eight to go postward. Kathy Hawk brings them out. Number two is My Lady's Pocket by John Tatum of Columbus, Ohio, trained by Karen Seifert, Dave Hawk will drive. Number three, Student Driver by Robinson, Robinson, and Mondillo, all of the Buckeye State, trained by Delvin Criswell, Jeff Fount. The four is Sugar Bug, owned by Rosemary and Andrew Stephen of Litchfield, Ohio, trained by Jeffrey Mallets, Brett Miller. The five is Max Gwynn by Turbulent Air Incorporated of Beaver, Ohio, trained by Seal and Harness with Jim Daly. The six is BB One by Michael Graney and Noel Graney of Ohio, New Mexico, trained and driven by Billy Walters. Number seven is Towner Sabrina by Rick and Tammy Brandon of Greenville, Ohio, trained by Craig Bowman, Sam Chipnoble the third. The eight tis now by Kathleen Borchers of Bellbrook, Ohio, trained and driven by Dean Collins. From the outside of the nine is Sharp Bonnet by Betty Jean Jordan of Clarksville, Ohio, trained by Laura Jordan, Jamie Dunlap, and her sulky. That's for a start. Field in motion. They're off fan pacing and firing away from the inside. There goes the three student driver who's fired up for command from the inside. My Lady's Pocket is going with her in two. Got to the outside. Third is Bibione is driving on to the inside. Racing in fourth, Sugar Bug dropping in. Racing in five, that is Towner Sabrina dropping in there. Racing in six, that is Max Gwen. Seventh along the rail there. That is Tiz now. Eighth there along the inside and trailing the field. That is Sharpanet as they step by the opening quarter in a hot one. Twenty. Seven and one foul. And student driver and fount with the lead here, but is surrendering to Bibione, who is driving on to the front end here. And Bibione and Billy Walters finally clears being parked three eighths of a mile. And Bibione with the lead here. Student driver is yielded for a garden spot, racing in two. My lady's pocket is racing third. A shovel back and forth at a sugar bunk to the inside and five is Towner Sabrina. As they step around the clubhouse, turning on over to the half. First over on the outside, racing in six there. That is Max Gwynn, who is towing along. Tis now to the outside of there in seventh and eighth and trailing the field. Third over is Sharpanet. They were halfway home in 57 and three fast. A second panel of 30 and two. Off the turn and driving down the backside from the inside of Bibione with the lead here. But now first over on the outside racing in two. That is Max Gwen. Student driver is watching over the doing leaders from third. Second over on the outside racing in fourth. That is Tis now. Buried at the rail racing in five. That is My Lady's Pocket wheeling by three quarters. Three quarters and one twenty six and three. Backside, 29 seconds flat to the inside. Bibione with the lead. Max Gwynn to the outside. These two are on inseparable terms as they turn to the top of the stretch. Less than an eighth of a mile to go. And down the stretch they come. Driving through Power Alley. Bibione to the inside. To the outside, Max Gwynn is still there. Still coming to her. To the inside, student driver. As they come within the final 16th, Bibione. Bibione in front. Finishing second, Max Gwynn. Third was the three student driver. The time of the mile, one fifty. Five flat, Bibione and a new lifetime mark. Winner's circle, the official winner of the 11th race and a new lifetime mark, 155 flat. Here's the six, Bibione. A three-year-old Bay Philly by Jay Tlobel out of a Lot Senna. She by Dragon's Lair by Michael Graney of Ohio and Noel Graney of New Mexico. Nicely trained and driven by Billy Walters. The six, Bibione. Now your official winner, new lifetime mark, 155 flat. Well, Scott, Bibione gets a new lifetime mark here as uh, she takes the 11th race. Billy Walters trains and drives, 155 flat, returns $524, 240. Second was the